So, um, one of my New Year's resolutions was I wanted to overcome some of my fears because I'm afraid of almost everything. One of my big fears is, um, my boyfriend's a big redneck. He likes to go hunting and fishing and he's a big outdoorsy guy. Um, he loves ice fishing. Loves it. And I am terrified of the ice. Um, Thursday is Valentine's Day. Today is Monday. But Thursday is Valentine's Day. And I'm like, you know what? I want to do something nice for him. I want to do something that he wouldn't be expecting. I'm going to go ice fishing. Uh, so I'm all bundled up. I'm get my, my whole garb on. Uh, it's bad enough that my weight is on the ice. But not only is it my weight on the ice, but I am in this lovely... I don't know if you can really see it. This lovely, lovely ice shack, which isn't that big. I mean, it fits the three of us. I'm out here with his uncle. But um, I'm, I'm going to show you the ice. Brent went through this huge speech at the beginning of winter because the ice was full of air bubbles. And he's like, I don't think that's safe. I don't know why it's full of air bubbles. I'm going to Google it. Google says that if the water has bubbles in it, you should not be on it. Well, guess what? All of the fucking ice has bubbles in it. Oh, here we go. I'm going to open the ice up. It's snowing, and it's so cold. But here's a hole. I don't think they really drilled this one. I'm going to touch it. No, I'm not going to touch it. No, they didn't do that one, I don't think. Nope. But all of the ice is like black and it's got bubbles. I'm going to die. There's Shore. Way over there. There's a little, little ice shack. There's our little ice shack. Brent's uncle's way over there. I'm going to go find you in an open hole, though, because you need to understand why I'm terrified. Brent is setting up a trap. We're fishing. For fishes on the ice, because this is what real rednecks do, right, Brent? Right. This big spot right there, that big dark spot, that's where all the water went. And he did the hole. This is what the hole looks like. It's actually really pretty, the size of it, because of the ice, but you can see where the ice stops and the water starts, and it's just terrifying. What are you doing right now? Think how deep it is? No, it's not fresh enough. This little fish is so open. Yep. Here are the little fishes. I went ice fishing with Brent last year, and I had a favorite fish. He's the biggest fish that they had, and I named him. And that was the last fish Brent killed that year. Well, that time we went fishing. So this is what I am doing for my lovely boyfriend, since I love him so much. He loves me too. Yay! And if I die, I'll be very sad. It was all for love. <laughs> Died for love, like <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Redneck version. Oh yeah, I'm going to go now. Go with Brian to the next hole. Well, why is all that water over there, Brent? That's where he popped all the water. Oh, that's a lot of water. Yeah. Okay, anyway. Bye.